according to the Wall Street Journal's 2009 CEO Compensation Study, CEOs of the healthcare industry received larger direct compensation packages than any other industry, with a median amount of over $12 million per year. As one example, Michael McAllister of Humana, a for-profit health care provider, received over $5 million in compensation last year, and he has realized over $700 million in long-term incentives, LTIs. And these figures do not include other compensations, options, and benefits, such as the $255,000 for McAllister's use of a private jet, the first $700 million plus savings toward a national health plan can be found by eliminating one person at Humana. Universal health care is not too expensive. We already spend more and get less health than any country in the world. Our money just does not buy consumer health. That level of inefficiency is what is un-American. National health is no more socialism than are our national highways. Both are national infrastructure. Health is not an industry or commodity. It is human capital. Tell our representatives in Washington to do what is right for all Americans. Fix the system or don't even think of running for re-election.